Welcome back to another video. Right now, we're going to make a very crispy version of Malaysia's Goreng Pisang or Banana Fritters. So basically, I have got two banana. You can use any banana you want, but uh, it shouldn't be too ripe. And I have uh, two sets of uh, flour. So this is like 50 grams of flour with a pinch of turmeric. And we're just going to add a little bit of salt. Okay. And then we have got here uh, just about uh, under 100 grams of flour with another pinch of turmeric. And again, uh, we're going to add some salt also here. Okay. Now, um, we are going to do a double coating to make it super crispy. So the first thing is we're going to slice open the banana first. So we're going to cut the banana into uh, two halves. Okay, so we're going to cut down the length of the banana. And uh, let's make it as, uh, as even as possible. Okay. Okay, and this too. Uh, I'm going to cut and clean up. From the two bananas, I've got four slices. Now, we'll make the wet batter first. I'm just going to add a bit of water to this. And we'll make a thick flowing batter. And I'll come back and I'll show you this. So, our wet batter is ready. So, this is a like very thick batter. Right? So, we'll concentrate on the dry batter or the dry coating. Right? So, right now, I'm just mixing the salt and the turmeric. Now what I'm going to do is, I'm just going to add in sprinkles of water, bit by bit. Now what we're going to do is, we want to make flakes out of this. Okay, so I'm going to come back. So right now, if you can see, it's becoming a bit flaky. And this is only water, flour, and turmeric, and salt. So if you want to use both hands, just to like wrap it in. Okay. And you want it to be small little flakes. Okay, just rub it in like that. Just rub it in. And this will form the outer coating, which will be very crispy. Now just um, keep keep rubbing between your hands and you'll see like it's going to become like small pieces of flakes like this. Well, you get the idea. Now come back shortly. So right now we're going to coat our bananas. And you can see like um, our dry mixture is uh, flaky and uh, it's good for making it very crispy. So. Take a slice of banana, coat it on the wet coating. Okay, so keep one hand dry, of course. Okay, so make sure it's fully coated with the wet coating first. And then just like remove as much coating as you can, the dry wet coating. Then put it in the dry coating. And then cover it with the dry coating. Okay, like this. And then try to press it in. So you can see like this is like a well coated. Okay, so I'm just going to leave this aside. Yeah, like that. Again, um, I'm going to do the second piece. Okay, so you, you, you get the idea. Let's put this here. Uh, I'm going to pause. So our banana has been coated, double coated, the wet coating and then the dry coating on top. Now we'll fry this. Got my vegetable oil heated up and these are my prepared fritters so i'm going to add in the larger piece in the middle okay. okay so we'll fry this and come back just gonna give it a flip make it separate Okay, so my banana paper is already. Can you see how crispy this thing is? I'm just going to remove this. 
all these extra edges are like super crispy edges I'm going to drain it on a kitchen towel like this this too wow it's super crispy and I'm going to fry the rest our super crispy banana fritters are ready and you see uh, how much of uh, outer crispy shell there is let's uh, have a taste test I'm just going to bring it nearer can you hear how crispy there is and super hot and steamy inside and super crispy outside wow try this this is a wonderful method to fry deep fry anything including chicken